selecting any hybrid, whether it's a standard silage hybrid, BMR, or a product like Enogen that has an amylase enzyme in the kernel, really depends upon the needs of the dairy. One of the things that no other seed industry has worked with the enzyme in the kernel is because the rumen is very capable of digesting starch. Rumen bacteria produce a lot of amylase, and you don't hear nutritionists asking to add amylase to the diet. So why would we really need it in a kernel? And we know that really that's all about starch, the, the Enogen proposal. It has nothing to do with fiber digestibility. It's not a BMR hybrid. So nothing bad to say about the hybrid or the yield because I don't have data to, to do that. But I will say that there's really been shown no advantage in dairy to feed an Enogen hybrid for improving starch digestibility. We already have dairies that have less than one or 2% starch in the manure. There now have been five papers published in the Journal of Dairy Science where they compared Enogen to the isogenic control. And in none of those trials was there an advantage in starch digestibility. The most recent one was published in 2024 by the University of Wisconsin, put up as both corn silage and as earlage. And in either format, there was really no advantage to the starch digestibility. So starch yield is, is something I can't address there, but in terms of starch digestibility, we don't see a big advantage there, and nor do you see the academics or the universities analyzing any kind of plot work, genetic yield data on starch digestibility because there really are no differences.